What's up guys, it's your boy Jay and welcome back to another episode of the EA Sports FC 24 career mode with JFC. What's up guys, 97% of you are not subscribed to the channel, so can we please make sure to like, comment, share and subscribe. Thank you very much. One of the most pivotal months in this season career mode's history. We've got the Champions League semi-final. We have got the FA Cup final, which will be rotated to hell, by the way. But with that, um, I don't really know what else I can say. Let's just get on to the festivities against Atletico Madrid. If we can beat Atletico Madrid in the semi-finals, we will have reached the Champions League final for the first time in this career mode. Again, they are not an easy side. No side in the semi-finals is easy in the Champions League. But the lineups are as follows. So it is Ramsdale, Brewer, Romero, Colombo, Sanchez, Bellingham, Doku, Popescu, Bertrand, Elekenia and Mbappe. For Atletico Madrid, it is Lang, Arthur, uh, Kim Minjay, Saliba, Timber, Malesia, Serrano, Bruno Gomares, McAllister, Randall Colomane, and Sergio Camillo. Oh, God, me, this side is good. Let's just get to it. Oh, my God, what a mistake. Oh, my God, that's worse. Jesus Christ. Come on, here we go. Stop, 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 stop. Mbappe. Kylian Mbappe gets the first goal in the semi-finals. That's fantastic. Play. This is good. This is good. All we got to do is just keep maintaining this and we'll reach our first ever Champions League final, which would be amazing. 1-0 uh, to JFC. Right, here we go. Half time. Not going to make any changes. Second half. Let's go. What a ball. What a ball. What a ball. That is the most amazing set piece straight from the other team's corner that I have ever seen in my life. That was absolutely awe-inspiring from what I have just seen from that attack. That ball straight over to Bertrand, straight through to Hall. That is amazing. 2-0 to JFC. And there we go. At the Jordan Stadium, we get the 2-0 win over the Spanish side of Letico Madrid. <sighs> Two big goals. And we are in the chance. We are in the running for our first ever Champions League final, which is amazing. It's good. It's brilliant, actually, if you think about it. Got time for a couple of questions. Yeah, again, very good performance. I'm so impressed by that George Hill goal, by the way. That was amazing. I, I couldn't be more proud. I legit could not be more proud of this team. But we got to take a little step away from the Champions League for two seconds. Because we have to rotate the hell out this side for Newcastle. Which, okay, we lose. That's fine. Some people get minutes. That's fine. Champions League matter more. And I think we've already won the league anyway. D does that basically confirm that we just won the league anyway? 36. Yes, it's 10 points. It's 10 points. We're, we're, we're fine rotating, which we need to do as we face Atletico Madrid again. So far, we have kept the 2 0 lead against Atletico Madrid from the first leg, but now the second leg is here, and Atletico Madrid have got everything to do in this league. In this lead, sorry, not league. In this lead. We have rotated, that means our side is fully fit and ready to go once again. Even though we lost to Newcastle, that does not really matter due to the rotation that we did indeed pull off. But one of the greatest teams in Spain, we are here to face them in the second leg of the Champions League semi-final. Now let's have a look at the lineups for JFC. It's Ramsdale, Brewer, Romero, Colombo, Sanchez, Bellingham, Doku, Popescu, Bertrand, Elkenia and Mbappe. For Atletico Madrid, it's... Lang, Arthur, Saliba, Timber, Kim Min Jae, Malicia, Sereno, Gamaraj, McAllister, Kulamani, and Camelo. Let's get to it. Go on, Mbappé's run it. Mbappé's run it. Come on, mate. Come on, come on. Bellingham has finally scored. Bellingham has finally scored. Belly goal. Belly goal. For Jude Bellingham as he scores to make it 3-0 on aggregate. I finally score with him, and that's how it works. 
but him just getting a deflection of a very bad pass from Mbappe, okay. Okay, you, you, know, you know what? That's fine. That's fine. Belly goal scores. 1-0. Come on, mate, go for it. It's four. It's four nil on aggregate. Two nil here in Spain as the crowd goes silent over what they are seeing tonight. We're doing absolutely amazing. This, this is what I need to see. Two nil to JFC. There it is. There it is, the third goal, meaning that we can just skip it all. We can just skip it all. And ladies and gentlemen, El Kenya and Mbappe gets two extra goals to make it 7-0 on aggregate against Atletico Madrid. Which means, ladies and gentlemen, we're in the Champions League final next episode. Oh my god, that is big. Right, we have got some games to skip because I have got a Champions League final in a couple of days. Right, and it's time for massive amounts of rotation. All right, first off, we lose to Spurs. No biggie. Man City, enjoy your point. All right, your three points. Next up, we have got Arsenal in the league, which means that we can just again get this lineup, just keep losing. Oh my god, 5 0. We lost 5 0 to Arsenal. Jesus Christ. Right, and finally, we have got one more game, which, wait, that means that we won't be able to lift a trophy. Hold on, let me just play a game because I definitely want to lift that trophy. Two seconds. In a couple of seconds, we will be lifting, hopefully, the Premier League trophy because I don't know if it actually will count or not. I don't know if it's already happened or not. But there's only one way to find out, and that's just by hoofing the ball up and calling ourselves... Premier League Champions of the World. Well, Premier League Champions of the World, that makes no sense. Ladies and gentlemen, we have won the Premier League. We have now won two out of the four trophies that we can win. We've won the Carabao Cup. We've won the Prem. All we need to do now is just win the FA Cup and the Champions League. And we would have won the quadruple with this fantastic team. I'm just going to let the celebrations go on a bit. And here we go, ladies and gentlemen. JFC has finally won the Premier League for the first time in this career mode. A fantastic feat for everybody. Well done to everybody involved. We've done it. We've actually done it. I know it's at the London Stadium and not at the Jordan Stadium, but we have done so much for this We've done so much and we deserve to be where we are right now on top of the world, on top of the English pyramid as we have won the Premier League. And literally next up, it's going to be the FA Cup final. So this might not even be our only trophy celebration that happens in this game. All right, Romero, lift it up, baby. Lift it up. There we go, even though it pants to the crowd for some reason, which is great. There it is, Premier League Champions. That's it, we've done it. We've actually done it. We have actually won the league this year instead of screwing it up like last season. We have done it. Fantastic, absolutely fantastic. 3-1 at the London Stadium just gives us the trophy. But the next game is going to be the one that I actually do care about. A big game over at Wembley Stadium against a, not a small side, but a small side on compared to what we've got to do. Let's get to the final against Ipswich Town. Because of this being before one of the biggest games of the year, 
I've checked. Ipswich finished like 17th, 18th in the league, in the championship this season. So therefore, we have just decided just to rotate this. I think it is worth rotating because next episode, everyone needs to be fit. Everyone needs to be ready to fight in the Champions League final. And it has been decided it, it is up against AC Milan. So the lineups go as follow. For JFC, it is Martinez, Cash, Akanji, Colombo, Mendy, Bellingham, Diouf, Troncho, Mbappe, Alicania and Labales. For Ipswich Town, it's Sherpin, Clark, Tranzebi, Wolfenden, Davis, Taylor, uh, L. Mazzuni, Nandez, Broadhead, Hutchinson, and Hurst. Let's get to it. See, I knew this game was going to be so one-sided. I literally just left it to commentary. First off, Trancho passed it to Kylian Mbappe to make it 1-0 in the FA Cup final at Wembley Stadium against Championship side Ipswich Town. Again, they are glad to be in the position that they am. But with even the rotated side, just proved to be too powerful. Mbappe gets past through the Ipswich player, straight through to Elekenya to make it 2-0 within 9 minutes and 44 seconds. We just knew that was going to be it. We just knew that was going to be it. And um, here's another goal. Mbappe passes it straight through to Elekenya again within 19 minutes to make it 3-0 against Ipswich Town and you know the rules when it comes to games are over 3-0 we normally seem to the end but since I wanted to watch us actually lift the trophy again uh, we just simulated through to the end where Ipswich scored a goal doesn't really matter as Troncho even managed to bag one at the depth 4-1 in this final overall against Ipswich Town such a fantastic feat that we have managed today here at Wembley Stadium, even with the rotation, even with bringing on some of the worst players we have in this team off on the bench to play, we still managed to live as we scored four goals in this FA Cup final to win the FA Cup. Ladies and gentlemen, next episode, it's going to be so pivotal as we face e AC Milan in the Champions League final. This has been your boy Jay. Please remember to like, comment, subscribe and peace.